Hello, my name is Grant. Now, let's start with a little bit more last hour for tonight. Last time I played, I... I was literally... Man, I... I went to the most... Strangest places, this place. This is one of the most strangest places i ever seen in a Zelda game. Doesn't work for Zelda. I have to say, I... My, exper my experience for that place was not good. What other people know, Zelda is not a survival horror type game, so why do you have... Well, why do you put random survival horror elements right into... Right into the game, it just makes no sense. I didn't get my sword because I uh, died at the boss, though, unfortunately. But yeah, it was, it, 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 it was very strange. It was. I don't know. Like I said, uh, survival horror elements belong to the survival horror game. My, my, my quirks about it was that, like I said, is that uh, my son's brother, 10 years old, he was there saying, Tell me some good Zelda classic that you should play. And I, said, I mentioned last hour. Now this guy, is, uh, this kid, he's like ten years old. What, what if he actually do get that far and see that? That's that's not that's not a good thing for a kid to see. And it just it's it's I don't know. I don't understand the minds. Uh, I think that's good because there's another thing in another quest so I'm not going to name, but a very strange thing that I'm not going to pretty much discuss on here. But it's. Yeah, you gotta watch out with some quests. Some strange things certainly do happen. You definitely see some strange things, I'll tell you that. Yeah, I wouldn't recommend this. To, I wouldn't recommend this game to any child now. Oh yeah, I don't want to be uh, using arrows for my thing. Okay, I still wasn't in there yet. I'm not quite certain where the entrance is because it's really hard to see with this with this mixed up uh, palette going on here. Yeah, there are some things that I'm against uh, seeing in this other game, and that's one of them. Now, I don't know where my logic's going there. That's definitely not going to work, and that's not going to work. That's not going to work. That's not going to work. Hmm. Let's see. That uh, I'm assuming, just by the color, that I was never able to get through that, so I'm assuming I need a different kind of arrow for that. Yeah, see, that one's silver. That one's silver, and that one's like, uh... It's like almost like a diamond color. What can I discover by going back into these houses again? Can I discover anything new, I wonder? No bombs. <clears throat> where can I get bombs? Yeah, you know what? I know where I can get bombs. I can get a load of arrows up here, too.
See, there you go. Four bombs there already. This is a great spot for grinding in this game, in my opinion. Okay, yeah, that's not for now. This is, uh... Let's get a bit much. I'm gonna buy uh, them bombs, huh? Actually, no, I'm just gonna go to the next area, eh? And if I, uh... Yeah, that's what I'll do. I'm gonna go back to... the. The factory and research center, apparently. Based off uh, nearly every survival horror game that's based in the future. Or present times like Resident Evil. Most survival horrors are based on that, anyways. Now, where am I going? Yeah. So I got all these pearls unlocked. I just noticed. So. There's nothing left on that. Oh, yeah. I'll get the sword just before the final level. I need to go up here. <clears throat> oh, 
Now. I should go up here. Damn. Oh no, I didn't get another potion. Uh, I won't need it. I wonder if there's something under that armor statue. It probably was. Okay, yes, that's right. Well, now I can check under that Armo statue now. What am I thinking? Just the... Uh, I can get up there in the daytime. And I probably already have. Yes, if I've been... Yes, I've been... I've been certainly at that door. Oh no. See now. Oh well. Now I know you can't. It just can't be done. Why not? But that's how you enter that room when the power's off. Come back. So let's go where I need to go. And there he goes.
No. I still need to go back to the castle and get that key. Yep. And now I'm back here. And in this room up here, I'm gonna need the uh, the arrows fly. That's why I left last time because I hate the old-fashioned animal statues. You can't. Okay, hold on. I don't want to lose any health going up here. And right away, I lose a heart. And the Gorilla Drop Hat, too. The Gorilla Gorilla Drop Hat. Hello? Power off. Definitely not gonna get you there. Yeah, I figured you wouldn't be able to read screens with power off. Just I was just looking for a bug. See if they left the. Uh, see if they left it behind, eh? Holy! What am I doing? So I see where I walk behind that tall that one screen. They hit. It's a solid tall, but they put it on the wrong layer. And therefore it just appears above your head. And no longer remaining solid. So I think I just gotta go back and turn the power back on now. We'll see. Yeah. I'm not getting over here. Hey, ain't those guys supposed to be shut down too, the skeleton robot guys?
Oh, damn. I'm pretty sure these enemies are from Chrono Trigger. Can we, end, can we just uh, end with the data? I found it today, I was playing the... Uh, Patio made another game uh, called... Uh, uh, Mega Man Dr. Raleigh's Revenge uh, Director's Cut and I've noticed that a lot of his tiles that he used for that quest were just a bunch of random tiles pulled from many different games. For example, uh, I think that there's, there's tiles pulled from Pokemon, Earthbound, Mega Man, and Chrono Trigger. Anything to make it look futuristic. And I've noticed that a lot of tiles that were in his Mega Man game he he pretty much carried over to this game. But it looks like he carried the best ones over. Like he didn't I don't see my Pokemon tiles there. He carried the best ones over, so it looks the best. That's what I'm taking now. Hmm. Oh yeah. I gotta go over here. See how annoying these things would be if that was wind. Yeah, I can see why. <laughs> oh man. Yeah, I was completely by anarchy mode. Oh. When you hear that music, you gotta hurry. Logbook entry number six. There is a sacred weapon on this island, which unfortunately is very strong against our lord. When the evil in the warlock, warlock, warlock or warlock, warlock will see it. I'm gonna say warlock inside the volcano. So then the main boss is warlock. I've been saying warlock. <laughs> oh my. Yeah, obviously, because we're all awkward. I don't know. Inside the volcano long ago by the Anders of that time. The Anders also created a magical weapon with their remaining power in case Warlock was to break the seal someday. Fortunately, this weapon was found by the Mor Morak, and now that the weapon is hidden deep inside the volcano so that no one can use its secret power against our master. The great and almighty Lord Mora, who shall be free soon. Oh, Glenn, that doesn't look like I gotta do that. No, oh, no, no, no. Oh, this is nice.
I'm really digging my help. Before this night is over, I want to try to get that golden sword too, so I'm going to end up. <laughs> oh boy! Oh, I know. So that must be an precious upgrade. No, I guess not. That is. That's me gonna die soon. Look how much life I got. Just letting anyone know, so everyone visits, you can actually log in and chat in the chat room. It says the chat is unavailable, only the only reason because there's no one here right now to chat. So I just say I just say there's a chat from uh, the recorder because it shares these videos on YouTube. But that does uh, I can still if you message on a chat, I would still be able to read your message, and then I can enable the chat. I hate that. That is so stupid to have that there like that. Something gonna happen here. Scanning. Intrude alert. Exterminate object. the boss? Oh shoot.
Maybe we can hit the fireballs and the uh, lasers. The old school bosses, I can't help but laugh at them. Bosses has gotten a hundred times better ever since they got unscripted, I'll tell you that. I'm having a bit of a connectivity issue. That hearing the sound, that's the connection drop and then coming back. Yeah, sorry for those watching the stream, I'm having a bit of a connectivity issue with the scene. Okay, I'll be right back. Okay, I'm back. Oh, I don't get this boss.
ました。うん You gotta kind of like make him hit himself. But I don't think I'm really doing anything to him. Uh, outside of that, I don't think I'm hitting him enough. Just like my sword's not strong enough. Now that is... Look at me. <sighs> my sword is not strong enough, or... I'm gonna use a stronger weapon, or... I don't know. It's a bit of a weird boss, isn't it? Suicide what was that? Oh man, oh man, oh man. Just right out of the blue. Zap, 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 dead. 
That's a terrible, terrible boss. That's that's not designed well at all. That's I feel like you're doing well and Zap 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 dead. Just right out of the blue. Before I even had the moment to respond, I was dead. Uh, I was just we'll say dead. Oh man, oh man. Sign that box. <laughs> yeah, <pretty> cool. <laughs> uh, no black bomb. <laughs> you clowns, you rejects. <laughs> you know, you probably don't ever want to die about <laughs> You can't just <laughs> <in> gaming. <laughs> Black Bomb. He's uh, smart, a smart guy, but he's he's half a bullshitter. I think he knows he's half a bullshitter. He's ha he's nuts, right? <laughs> don't mind, don't mind insult everyone. <laughs> you clowns, you corporate slaves, you, you rejects on the internet. <laughs> oh man. The hell away from that thing now. Jeez, I'm just standing there minding my own business with that. Huh? I figured that would happen. Yeah, good. No, I got. Hold on, he's dead. This, this! What the hell is this? I'm using up my arrows on this retard. That's... oh well. That's... that's a thing. Predict where I'm gonna shoot, boss. I predict everything I'm gonna do because you're gonna only have a split second to respond. The the fuck. 
fuck you, boss. <laughs> you said you were doing good here. Fuck you, that's what the boss is. It's either a fuck you boss or just a complete lack of understanding of human comprehension. Yes, human people are naturally prone to have some reaction to everything around them, like madness. Gee, you can barely walk on that screen. <laughs> That's a you must use your potion here kind of boss. Well. That's nice for a game that gives you limited potions. Oh my. No. There's not enough time to do this because you're gonna have taken a whole shitload of damage. Oh, this boss is a fail. It's over. This boss is shit. I'm... I'm at 6 and I'm just leaving this place and coming back to this another time. That's... that's a fail. Gonna use, gonna use every hour I got on that piece of shit. That's retarded. That boss... oh, that is... that is not... that's not designed like... look, look! <laughs> oh my... Actually, no, I hope you use Miles. Apparently, it continues here, so that's it. Very right now. Oh, that boss is horrible, man. It's designed on the expectations that people are supposed to automatically know what it's going to do. Like a random death being good to death dead. Wait, really? What? Okay. So you're gonna script it, uh, so it jumps and stuff like that? Do it like, make it like Vincer. Like, 10 heart damage unless you attack it quick enough, no matter where you are on screen. The fucking rainbow. What did they call it? What did they call it? Uh, something rainbow. They have a nickname for his attack. Uh, well... I just saved it, so... So if I use arrows, I'll just quit and continue rather than just using up all oh, my... Screen. Right, I don't know what's going to do. It's sketching me right out, that's what we're doing. Now, is there any way to kill this? What? 
Can I survive that? Oh my... You... You are not an ordinary intruder. Lord Morlock was right about you. You are a serious threat to his plans of breaking out of the island seal. And eventually consuming this lovely planet to non-existence. You know you have to return to the fortress if you wish to advance further in your little adventure. Face me, and you shall surely perish. Okay, ugly. Ooh, if I die out here. You got the god upgrade shit. Wow. That's that's good stuff. Talk. I'm not good for my words either, so... <laughs> oh, I'm not gonna be sent! Well, I could've been around that with my... with the stuff I got now. And perhaps... go to hell. <laughs> oh, my. That's why I'm gonna, I'm gonna continue now, and uh, I'm gonna buy that bomb upgrade that I can't afford. Of course, I can't afford it now. And then I'm gonna explore around with my new rod upgrade. Woo! It does exactly like I thought it would do. Hopefully I get enough arrows now. Slaughtering the innocence of animals in a cave. That went pretty nicely, I think. Hopefully I got enough. It's a robot. Do you expect it to know how to speak? Ah, uh, wait a minute. What am I misunderstanding here? Where is this upgrade supposed to be? I don't remember! Oh wait. Oh. That, that had me panicking then for a second here. Ah, newcomer. Want to carry more explosives? Pay for the joy. <laughs> Have you been there? Uh... Perfect. Have you been pay- uh, the little, uh, turn to its dinner? Have you been, uh, watching my other series of, uh, Power of Gedwina? 
the German <laughs> game. The, uh, the game that can only play if I got Avatar <laughs> translating the game for me. Well, someone had like, someone had to translate that game because they said it's in the top ten, the top ten games in the uh, pure ZC. But now, what can you call top ten really? Because you know that people rate, rate these quests. There's some uh, there's some people there that plays every single every quest. <laughs> uh, rates every quest uh, five out of five. You can't trust nothing. You can't trust rating. You can't trust. Yeah. Okay. Connection just split for a second there. Anyways, as I was saying, you can't trust nothing. You can't trust ratings. Like, uh. It takes place in said movies, not that or anything. You can't trust the ratings, you can't trust the popularity, and you could say you can just rely on your own instincts, but you can't trust that because you really don't know what. <laughs> you could you could really love something like one one day, and then a year or two down the road, say man, one day, and like that. So you really it's all garbage. <laughs> Novelty wears off of everything. And you're sitting there and saying, ah, man, that movie sucked. How could I ever like that movie? They're saying it's quest, how could I ever like that quest, eh? A terrible, terrible quest, though, you know what I'm saying. I don't think. No, I can't get that there. Yeah, whatever it will be, yes, but I, uh, can have more optimal, don't ya? OBS is useless, too. Doesn't want to work half time. Now I can finally get that. Bye. 
So what am I gonna find up here? Another shield, another potion, a bomb. Damn. <laughs> I should have just left that alone. One of those I think. Well, it doesn't matter. All these yellow things will only drop more. Huh. Oh yeah, I don't want to do that. I tell you, if there's like 20 rupees in this cave, I'm gonna have to shit. <laughs> Like seriously, it's uh... Okay, see, there's no point to get a shield in this game. There really isn't. I would have lost my shield then. These like incredibly high HP lake likes everywhere in the game. Everywhere. Oh no, I'm already starting to get a bad sign. Oh! And, oh. And that's why I don't like hard piece containers. Until you complete all four, they're valueless to me. I don't. When I was younger, when I used to play a Link to the Past, I used to always get excited when I see an hard piece container. But now, after playing so many quests, and seeing her and so many hard piece containers, I. The joy of hard piece containers is gone. Just give me the heart. Just give me the damn heart. <laughs> <laughs> Give it over with, my god. And then there's Twilight Princess, oh uh, jeez, five hearts. All you're collecting is a tease. You're just collecting what, what could be. Only after you click three more. <laughs> now. So. See, and that's a. That's a pain there, too, because look, look what that's doing me, like. I can't complete this map because those screens, even if I walk in those screens, they are still, well, whatever. Now. See, that looks like it's there for something, but I came to the realization that all that is is for looks. Can't be, though, because you can walk down there. You can even raft to get over here, and then we met with that blue tree that I don't know how to get rid of. It looks like a secret there, right? And I'm not really understanding it. Okay. Down I go. Back to that dreaded place. I'll get myself a better sword. Where to? Hmm. Let's realize something. Uh, oh, it's. Just a shortcut. Something terrible here. You mean you can get back here? The only thing I can possibly think of. Do you actually just burn the blue tree? 
Is that how it works? Oh my, burn the tree! Yeah, whatever. Well, one of my things, really. But hat. Same, just the same thing in the All Rebirth, but the All Rebirth kind of makes it more obvious. It's like, it's a tree that looks like fire that stands out from everything else. That's it. Oh, no, I don't need it right now. You can't complain about it when you need it. Oh yeah. OBS is acting up again. Okay, I'm back there now. Anyways, I said, I guess you can't complain when you need it. Oh my god, really? OBS is really getting out of there tonight. What does OBS stand for? Oh bullshit? Ah, no, really. I should, uh, get some rupees in this area here before I go down. Go down to, uh, Doom Cave. <laughs> I doubt I'll need another potion. But then again, ugh. I seriously believe that that cave is unnecessary. To have that much, to have that much going and so again, now mind you, it's not that much. It's rather a mob, but still, we're talking about the Zelda game. But, but yeah, that almost reminds me of. It's just, it's just a weird thing some people put in quests. Why does, why does the Zelda game need any amount of door? It's, it's so, like, dead. <laughs> Half cut off dead bodies hanging on chains. That's, that's, like, that's something you see in Fallout. Uh, like the, the models you see in Fallout. Fallout's not a horror game, but it's it's it, it, it's the type of game that you would see that in. But not Zelda. Why Zelda? A Bob the Bar. So I guess I gotta go back. <laughs> because I'm curious if that's there now. And besides, I'm not more hours than it is on the day. And hopefully, I will get another potion. And hopefully, that's what that's going to lead me to, is a potion. Because I would like that right now. It's never useless when you need it. And I'd like to know about the super hidden shop where you can buy potions. But now it's super hidden for a reason. They, they want you to try to beat the game legitimately without super shops. But 10 potions in the entire game? And let my mind you, that's half potions. Oh, and. Oh my. Thank you, OBS. Back again. Bad love all the day. Get a few arrows.
Huh. Okay, whatever's supposed to be here. Are you sure about yourself uh, on that one? I just did. What? On the rock? Oh, God damn it. Yeah, sure, just... What? Okay, some super hidden thing. Oh, no. Nah. <laughs> oh, I heard, I heard about these phrases. I heard about this. Um, Master Dome. We had it super hidden for a reason. That's that. That's all I need to know. I don't need to go in there. Not right now. Yeah. Master Dome. You know, if you hadn't shown me that, I probably would have went the whole game not even got it. Not even been there because... Again, I was about to conclude that that was nothing. Master Dome. I don't feel like I'm ready to go in there as of yet. to this place. Let's continue. Okay. Well, it's a good thing I got out of shortcut shape map, anyways. There's a little bit of blood there, and that fur you goes down the worse it gets. Got me then. Ooh. Oh, 
Okay. Oh, they almost got me then. Okay, I'll be right back. That's my son. He must have. Okay, I'm back. Yeah, he he was in the room. He he had a bit of a nightmare. No, no. Oh my God. <laughs> Did anyone see that was going to happen? <laughs> yeah, he woke up from his uh, sleep in the room. So he had some kind of, and he was crying about it. So he had some kind of a bad dream or something. Oh my god, this is... I'm going through this terribly. Oh man. Even with the shortcuts um, unlocked, this is not fun going through. Got sucked into that thing. Just that pull of the leaf? I use, I use. Hmm. Did I even save because I would have to go through all that again? Did I even save? Before, when I got there? No, I don't think I did. Uh, no. To get that out of there, I'm gonna have to do it again because I don't think I saved and I don't want to use my potion and then die and then have to. Oh well, because I don't know if I saved. So I will have to go through that again. That's, that sucks, but that's, that's just what I gotta do now. Sorry. That's not too hard to get down though. But I do only have three hearts. Thank <laughs> you. 
Well, I got my hair strike, anyways. Get more strike. Oh, well, there you go. I really do hate traps when they're in, when they're placed improperly. Ah! Now I'm gonna have a tough time, and I now this is when it's just gonna when the game is just gonna give me the middle finger. The game is giving me the middle finger now. This is gonna turn to a rage quit. And then I'm going to have to continue again tomorrow. For anyone who's never been here, I'm, sca I'm skipping out of the fucked up scenes of this place. This place is a bit... I don't know, it's a bit twisted. <laughs> it's a bit odd. It's not for kids. And it's too lame for adults. So I don't know who it appeals to. Sure, the place I'm thinking is just down there. Just for those who are curious, why not? Well, look at this. Well, should the debate time? Should this be in a Zelda game? You tell me. Should this be in a Zelda game? Well, I don't think so. It's inappropriate for Zelda. Either way, to each his own. <laughs> oh no! Yeah, it's, it's... This bench is not for kids, I'll tell you that. I wouldn't recommend this game to any kids just because this dungeon is home. I just think it's I just think it's immature to want Zelda that Yeah I know. Hold on. Hold on. Oh thank god. Yeah, but thing is, everything else is on par with, uh, oh, on par with previous other games. Take, for example, The Dark World and Link to the Past. That, that, that had a dark tone, but nothing, nothing like that. That's, that's, that's uh, a mild survival horror type dark tone. Like the dark web, you know the that skull forest. You see, you see skeletons and death all around, but it's skeletons, and that's for some reason children is well, skeletons is all about Halloween. 
better. Oh, I really mean, could go pretty bad too, so now. Now. This cave? <laughs> See, that's supposed to be. According to it, that's supposed to be a pool of blood and flesh piece. Uh, look at that. Flesh pieces uh, floating around. Then the rest to each own. I don't want a dark tone, but the, this entire cave is to the point that it's silly. This is too silly with it. Hello, oh, grab your hands. Like I said, who does it appeal to? I play enough survival horror games that that doesn't uh, give me the chance. And it's not fitting for its other games, so it's lame for adults. Uh, oh, this must be on the side. It's lame for adults, and it's absolutely frightening for children. So who does it appeal to? It's just it just appeals to the quest offer. That's that's how it appeals to. Love Jess and a rape. But I'm four out of five baby else agree. I'm getting through this pretty well. Yeah. And then Oh yes, but I don't have the word because I oh, okay, that's perfect. I guess I'm offended where I'm like where I'm a father, right? Suggesting that the uh, DFW is into a little bit of pain. <laughs> oh, that's nuts. <laughs> oh my. <laughs> Jesus Christ. This. This silly place. <laughs> Okay, yeah, I'm using arrows. I'm using every item I've got just to get this guy out of the way and then there. Yeah, I prefer scripted bosses above oh, ah, these kind of bosses. Oh no.
I can't script either. So I know it's the feeling. This path looks retarded. <laughs> I can't ever laugh. I'm... Come on back up, boy. Take your time. this to the night so I'm a little bit more prepared for it this time. Oh my god! I'm in a good, comfortable spot. <sighs> no where is it? Thank God. <laughs> I feel sorry for it. Why? You got death, sir. You got good English. What I got you was oh. Hold on, there's a long way I got a dead sword now. What's it gonna do, poor Mask of Mara? I mean, blow us an explosion to my face? You got it. Oh my. That's a evil, evil sword. It was a very evil sword. I do not trust this evil sword. I want to throw it away before I am cursed for life. Shit, I can't throw it away. It was that evil. Well, for now, I'm just going to try to take him care of the basic sword. Oh. Slays destroy everything with butter. What a nice sword. What a nice even sword. Huh? Zap. Gone. He was there and then he was gone. My aspect was like a chain of the land of Avatar. 
Had to actually die and pat and everything. No! Should I go back to, uh... The futuristic area that doesn't even feel uh, suitable for a zombie game? That I really like? Another unsuitable area for a zombie game? But I can't complain because I like that dungeon. But I don't know, I don't like what I was just saying because it's just inappropriate. It's inappropriate. It's inappropriate in the troll, I thought. Oh, I believe, in my opinion. Wait, I got Triforce pieces now, can... What happens if we use my Orcarina? Hmm. Actually, now I use and I'm gonna go somewhere I don't wanna go. I will put that theory to a test another time. I doubt it does anything. Oh, and I used my last potion. No potion for me. I killed a giant skull. How intimidating can a giant skull really be? Uh oh. I'm not over far enough. My trick for this place is stay right up far around the edges. And arrows are becoming ever more useless. Wait, I didn't even have a sword beam until now, did I? No. I just realized something. Where do I go? Huh. I know I got the item in the dungeon, but... I never did bother to find out exactly what I used that item on. Well, I haven't been over there yet. And... Sure, it's blinking... Up there. Huh. Let's go to where it blinks. Find out why. Ooh. I don't remember the actual path to get in there when it's... Huh. Because I'm pretty sure I don't want to be in there when it's dark. Oh, 
my nose I got a technique. <laughs> a technique for that. Okay, there might be. Uh, I don't have a clue. No, I don't. I think that technique. Uh, I have a technique that's imaginary in my head <laughs> because it's not seeming to provide actual results. Ah, let me go down there now. Yeah, see this. I haven't been to that area yet. That rod had to have provided. Oh my! That rod had to have provided something useful. Power off. Let's see what's. There's nothing here. Okay, gotcha. Okay, wait a minute. I might be able to get to the left area with the power off now. Sure, wait now, there's a power switch over there. Uh, so I probably I definitely have been over there with the power off. Now it's time to just... Check around. That's the fighters. That'll just send me down that room regardless. 
my father on the same spot. Okay, now all I did there was push that switch and then went down here. Okay. Okay, now I'm over here. Have I even been over here yet? It almost looks like I... Hmm. It almost looks like I haven't... Yeah, I just haven't been over here. <laughs> almost looks like... No, I haven't been over here. So... Now I have. Wait, that's number two. I still don't have two open yet? Hmm. Well. Looks like I'm making some progress here now. I've made rather significant progress tonight, I'd like to... I like to think. Door three is open. All right. Wait. Yeah, of course. Whoa. So what did I accomplish? Unfortunately, I'm very uncertain of what I actually did accomplish them. Oh! 
I could see that uh, Bush was saying. So wait, what did bring over that switch to? Okay, just put down the defenses there. But what good was that doing to me when I can't go up? Uh, or can I? Okay, now that. Oh, that's. So that's no good from there. Okay, I see. I got the feeling I'm gonna need switch too. I can go either way. I like big dungeons and small dungeons. Okay, I can't get in that room. Unless... Huh. Oh shoot, I can't... How do I get up there again now? I might give up that night right now because I just don't. I'm just forgetting everything and it's starting to get late. Oh yes, uh, the power got me off, don't want for me to go up there. Yeah, um, yeah I think that's going to be awkward tonight then. Yeah, so okay, that's... 
that's pretty much uh, how it's going to be for tonight. So, uh, I'm going to leave it there, so thank you for watching, and have a good night.